This video shows the error on a SQL server uh, on version 15 that when you want to restore some files we have the two problems uh, there is the that's in my default folder uh, where I have a lot of backup files and the same backup files are in a backup folder uh, where I have the same ones you see those files and when I try there to restore a database then this will uh, get an error so we go here to device first we have the first error now when we try to add the databases you see now I am in the target for or in the source folder where the backups are stored so this is my web apps web databases I can't see those that stuff it's the same the same folder when you watch there web development web apps web databases it's the same stuff web databases no not this one so I told a little bit of shit ah yeah uh, it's it's not a shit no <laughs> uh, it's, it's the right one Th that's the that's the original one and it won't see that stuff there sorry so that's the web apps web databases now you see this is the web databases web databases the same folder but you can't see them there so they are not there and when I go back and say okay now I'm go to the original to that folder where I have stored those uh, uh, files web server web database now you see those ones and when I you see that folder you can see you see the same fi same files everything is the same but uh, the folder is different and uh, it can't read them it can't see in them so and when I try there to restore one when I pick up the one from there say okay now uh, restore first it loads it's also able to uh, see that stuff when I try to uh, restore it and I will get an error the error says here restart of uh, database and then here is it restart container validate target for creation um, the error is five uh, the access is not permitted for uh, for that folder so this is it, uh, an error which happens somewhere in Microsoft uh, SQL Server uh, I don't like that 